We drew inspiration from paper and ink. However, unlike real paper, our digital material can expand, reform, and reshape intelligently. Material has physical surfaces and edges because the human mind is wired at its most primitive level to instinctively understand objects and their relationships. Those scenes and shadows provide meaning about what you can touch and how it will move. In the real world, every small change in position and depth creates subtle but important changes in lighting and shadows. So as part of the L preview, we'll now allow app developers to specify an elevation value for any UI surface. And the framework will render it in correct perspective with virtual light sources and real-time shadows. Material design is beautiful and bold because clean typographic layouts are simple and easy to understand. Your content is the focus. So the L preview will allow app developers to easily colorize all framework elements in your app to match the theme to your brand. And we're previewing a new support library that we call Palette to easily extract colors from images and really put those vivid pictures front and center. We're giving designers familiar tools, like baseline grids that work across screens. Grids ensure apps have a consistent rhythm and character, and this will allow you to start with a design on a phone and logically and easily bring that same design to tablets and laptops. Now, one design doesn't mean one size fits all. Our guidelines allow you to appropriately adapt the UI. So your users will already know their way around your app, no matter what screen they use it on. And we've also updated our system font, Roboto, so that designers and developers can use one typeface designed and optimized for every screen, from your watch to your laptop to your television. So now let's talk about animation. It's delightful when your touch is rewarded with motion, and material surfaces slide around with the physics of cardstock. But they respond to touch with splashes of virtual ink that are like ripples in a pond. As part of the L preview, all of your application's UI building blocks have been updated to include rich animated touch feedback. And no detail is too small to bring a smile to your face, like when the reload button loops around or the playback controls can change. Finally, in the real world, nothing teleports from one place to another. And that's why it's so important to animate every change on screen in a way that makes sense. In the L preview, Android developers will now be able to create seamless animations from any screen to any other, between activities and even between apps. So you're probably wondering how this looks like in practice. We're going to give you a sneak peek at one of our familiar Google applications in the new material design. Here you can see, step by step, how we update the design. The typography, the grid changes, and finally, the surfaces and bold colors. And a few small changes make a really big difference. And you can also see how easy it is to take that same design to different screens. Now, I've talked about only a few of the highlights of material design and just some of the APIs that you can try out in the Android L preview. But as we all know, people spend an enormous amount of time on the web, and especially the mobile web. Last year at I.O., we announced Polymer, which is a powerful new UI library for the web. Today, we're bringing you all of the material design capabilities to the web through Polymer. As a web developer, you'll be able to build applications out of material design building blocks with all of the same surfaces, bold graphics, and smooth animations at 60 frames per second. That was good. So between the L preview and Polymer, you can bring the same rich, fluid material design to every screen. And to help you take full advantage of this framework, 
We've also completely redesigned and created one unified set of style guidelines for every screen and for all devices. These guidelines will help designers and developers alike understand best practices and build consistent, beautiful experiences. We're releasing the first draft of these guidelines as part of our preview today at google.com slash design.